nerds. So for today, I am going to be unboxing and uh, reviewing the PLM uh, Diorama Mansion. Um, this is the marble um, one, the marble like background or whatnot. You can see it kind of right there. And I'm gonna open it up. Now I have to say, I only have one of these. I have these, these, uh, these, uh, dioramas and I think they're great if you are an action figure collector just because this is something that you can just set on your shelf and then you can set an action figure in front of it um like if you say like a Funko Pop or they have these other ones they're called I don't know I have one here just to to show it along with this thing but <clears throat> Um, I really do enjoy these things. Like I said, I only own one more of these. I own the, the study. Uh, but I plan to order some more of them, especially they have the Gryffindor Common Room coming out, uh, I believe, early next year. Um, so I'm excited to open this and, like, build it and just uh, see what it looks like and everything. So uh, why don't we just stop wasting some time and jump right into it. Here we go. All right, so let's just dive right into this. We're going to cut this open. And then we're going to pop open this. Now, all right, there we go, and it comes in plenty of different pieces. Now, it's got these little, these little pieces, and this is what I'll use to um, put together these, these uh, panels, and there's three of them, so two walls in the floor, and we'll just put these together just like this. Or the other way, whatever you want to do it. Okay, and then. All right, so if you just take a look at this, I'm just gonna spin it a little bit, and it looks very cool. I like the way that these <clears throat> dioramas sit. I think it's very cool. They're very like simple, but yet they really add something to your collection. And if you sit these little these little figurines, I don't know what these are called, but this is my daughter's. because She likes Elsa and everything. And then you can also sit Funko Pops on there. And it just brings a, a something, I think, to your figurines. You can also fit six inch action figures there. Anything above that I think would be too much. But I think that these, these kind of things uh, really work when you're trying to decorate, but you don't want to put like a bunch of detail into it yourself and actually build the dioramas yourself. So I think that these work really well. And let's just take one more look at this without figurines on it. And like I said, this one's really great. I really like this one a lot. All right, so tell me, what do you guys think about these uh, little PLM uh, diorama mansion uh, uh, dioramas? I think they're pretty great. I like this one a lot. Like I said, this is really great when you want to uh, decorate your and, and kind of make your action figures look cool without spending a whole bunch of money on, on doing little things that uh, yourself and everything. And like I said, this will just go on a shelf and then it'll probably have an action figure in front of it. And uh, again, I think these are really great, easy to put together. You just put these little toggles in the back and everything and put it together into this like little box almost kind of thing. But yeah, like I said, these are great uh, and everything. Uh, so tell me, what do you guys think about these? Um, do you guys like these things? Do you not like these things? Uh, I just want to say that if you like my videos and you like my content, please make sure to like, share, and subscribe. Uh, hit that notification bell. Uh, drop a comment in the comment section because it feeds the algorithm. And I will see you guys on the next boxing and review. You guys have a good day. <laughs> Bye. Hey guys, if you like this, go ahead and check out my main channel at Geek What. Link in the description down below. If you want to help support me even more, you can check out my merch store also in the link down below. Thanks so much. I really appreciate it.